Hey guys, today let's learn how to fix allow access to camera missing on iPhone applications. So in the case that you cannot see the specific option to allow the specific camera to access specific applications, in this video tutorial, I'm going to teach you guys step by step just how to do this. So please watch this video until the end to find out how. All right, guys, what we need to do first is to tap on the settings application and all of the applications that you have downloaded on your device is going to be located on the lower part of your settings, as you see here. What I want you to do from here is to tap on the specific application that you want to go ahead and allow access to camera on so once we're here let's just use for an example the messenger applications as you see we are going to have this option on the camera to well be used on the application if you have this enabled, basically the application will have access to the camera and that should solve your problem. But in the case that you cannot see this option available under the settings of that specific application, well, you got to make sure that that application actually uses the camera or needs to use the camera in order for it to function properly. Now, of course, not all applications will uh, ask for access to the camera. And let's say that you are using, uh, let's say, an application like this one right here. So as you see, this application doesn't doesn't necessarily need the access to camera so it doesn't show that on its settings but in the case that a specific application actually uses the camera and you can't necessarily use it since it's not shown under these settings to enable the access to that application well you gotta go ahead and launch the app stores search for that specific application on here and make sure that you have the application updated to the latest version it might be a bug so go ahead and just update your applications to the latest version so that bugs like that would be fixed you are going to have the best user experience possible and of course more features is going to be added to the application once the update is finished so that's all for this video guys thank you guys for watching please like this video and subscribe as well if you guys learned something and i'll see you guys on the next one take care